Get ready to dominate the paint. Today I'm going to show you four strong finishes at the rim that will have your defenders wishing they never stepped on the court. Let's level up your game. Let's go right into how we're going to level up your game today with paint finishes. We're talking about driving to the middle of the paint, this red area, going to the center of the rim. Strong for four solutions, okay, for four strong solutions. And let me give you the situation. First situation is if you have your primary defender that's closely guarding you and you cannot create separation. Separation also means spacing. You can't create separation and distance from them. They're playing you tight on your inside hip and shoulder. Ball in my left hand, I'm driving to my left. That means they're guarding my right hip and right shoulder. They're tight on me. I have to have a solution to get to the basket. And I gotta probably finish off two feet. Why two feet? One, I'm less likely to get injured. Number two, I can finish strong with four different solutions. It gives you more options. The more options you have, you play with more composure. The more composure you have, you have more balance and timing and peace. Put peace in the comments below, right? That's the first situation I wanna explain. Your primary defender is on you tight, playing your inside hip and shoulder, and you cannot create separation and distance. The second situation is you beat your primary defender. Now you have a help side defender coming from either the strong side, the side that you are on, to step up and take a charge and challenge your shot, or the weak side, okay? You wanna learn how to finish strong at the paint. And here are the shots. They all start with a push floater slash jump hook, up and under, or step through, up and around. The fourth solution is gonna be what I call spin the wind. all start with the push floater slash jump hook. We're talking about a shot that you're gonna basically push up, but by protection, outside your ear. So wherever the side the ball is on, that's how you're gonna go up. Where now you have a situation where you have the ball being protected by your body, and then you have the defender. So you wanna have that ball, body, defender effect. So now when you attack the basket and you go with the push floater, it's easy to get off whether you want to work on your right, coming in with the same shot, coming off your right hand, okay? Right, so that's the shot, okay? That's the situation I'm explaining. Let me give you now the solutions, starting with the push floater. First, you want to learn to come up to the basket, right, scoring. I want to push the ball up, see? Also, here's the key, little trick. When you jump, you hold the ball for a second in the air, then turn your body. So when I'm coming in, I don't just turn to shoot in their face. What you do is you jump in the air to sail, then you turn. Now your body should be facing the baseline. Right, and again, I'm coming up, push low. That's first solution. Right, coming in, I jump, I release it away from them. Right, I jump and release the ball away from them. I jump. Release it away from it. The second solution is going to be when they take away your push floater, now you have to learn how to create balance and footwork. So a balance and footwork, the first move I want to teach you is what's called an up and under or a step through. Now when I come in and I show my push floater and take it away, I get low, I show it. Now I have to go up and under their arms and change sides. We also call that a step through. Whether you're tall or small, these moves will work for you. Coming in, show, get low, and then go. Right? That's me doing it with my left hand. Here's what I'm doing with my right hand. I come in, I show it, boom, I get low. Right? Now I can be directly as a layup at the rim where you still have that jump hook option. That's an up and under. First solution is going to be the jump hook, push floater. Second solution is going to be the up and under. Now I gotta show you up and around. When you attack the rack, look at my footwork. Now when I come in, the defender's more in front of me. So I can at this time go with that step through or up and under. I have to now go up, fake up, and then go around them. So as I come in, I fake up, then I step around them, and now it's like a left hand, left foot shot, right? Coming in, I get low, I show, then I go. Right, like a left foot, left hand shot. Like a left foot, left hand shot, correct? We got that? There we go. I come do the same thing on the right side. Right, giving you a good breakdown. 
Come in, I show it, I go. Right, come in, show, go. Come in, show it, go. Okay? Now, the fourth solution is going to be what I call spin the wind. Now the defender's playing you tight and intense with pressure. That defender's really on your right hip and shoulder tightly. Now, any move you make to that jump hook is not going to be there. That push floater's is not going to be there. Now you have to take the ball and go completely around them and spin to win, right? They're playing you tight. Now they're going to play my left hip and shoulder real tight. I got to set up my outside foot, plant it, place it, and go with a spin move. Those are solutions right there. I want to give you the simple explanation, show you how to do it. Now I'm going to put all those in game shot situations. Let's go. Hey, we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year. We need your help. We roll out high quality videos every week to help you become a pre basketball player. Help us reach our goal and click that subscribe button. I'm going to go through all four of the shots, of the progressions. I'm going to make two shots each, left hand two, right hand two, all right? So I can show you how you can actually work this stuff out. Really push yourself using your off hand. May not be your strong hand, but really push yourself. Do your best. If you really struggle with using your off hand to score, use your good hand, all right? Now all I'm going to simply do is spin the ball out. We're talking about attacking the paint. Tall or small, don't matter. When you're coming from the perimeter, going to score, or you actually had your back to somebody coming in for those same solutions. I'm gonna just do it as I'm spinning the ball out, all right? I'm gonna spin it out, I'm gonna catch the ball, I'm gonna attack the rim, and I'm gonna go. And I'm gonna go into those solutions, okay? I'm making two shots each, here we go. Now first is gonna be the push, float, or jump hook. Jump stop, come in, attack, shot. That's one. Right, first shot we talked about. Come in, shot, fake, attack. That's two. Now I'm gonna do it going to my right. Spin it out, live ball, dribble, come in, jump stop, away from it, right? Mix up how you go into your scoring moves. Sometimes go off a rip, sometimes go off of a, off a live ball move, okay? Now here is my up and under, right? Mix up how you go. Here's the up and under. I catch it, I attack, I fake it, I go up and under. Make sure you jump off of two feet. Commit to the air off of two feet. Because if not, they'll cause travel. Up and under. Change sides. Spin out. Double move. Attack. Up and under. Shot fake. Attack. Up and under. Right now, here I go, up and around, up and around move, catch it, float, attack, here, up and around, right, up and around move, let's get it, show, go, up and around, let's get it. Good work. Right, now, last move is spin the win. I'm gonna go one side. One each, both sides, let's go. Catch it, attack, get to the rack. Spin move, flip. Last one, catch it, attack him, spin move. Get to the rack. And then you have it. That's how your defenders want to wish they never stepped on the court with you. Let's go. I want to make sure we're taking your game to the next level. So I'd like to offer you a gift that covers all the must know basketball principles. Click that link in the description below to download. And if you're really interested in becoming a premium basketball player or as a coach, taking your team to the next level, contact us for in-person training. That's right. We will travel to you and lead a customized camp clinic or a training session that I guarantee you as players and as coaches will take your mentality and your physical skills in basketball to the next level to dominate in every game. Enjoy your gift, keep attacking. I look forward to talking to you soon.